Hello everyone, this is another video review of Busun Shinki. This time is MMS Type Fighter Oscar. Nope, not the Oscar from Evangelion. So first of, first of all, a bit of a box art. Quite clean box art this time. I quite like this pastel, light pastel color actually. Um, again, some, some more detail on the side. Detail about the game and a bit more extra post on the side. And once again, a good window for for the figure and some extra post and more detail of the figure. So let's move on to the figure itself. So this is Oscar in in unarmed blanket form. Uh, a bit of a traditional style uh, design here, mostly white with a uh, dark red detail on her. You there's not much of a theme going on here, basically. Um, hair is pretty straightforward. Uh, almost solid black I don't think there's any shading on it no there isn't and um, let's see are we focusing on the face yep well even if it's focusing on the face you can't really see it so it does come with two facial expression one is smiling which is this one and the other one is a bit more blank a bit more serious face but you can't see the difference because this is a serious face and this is angry face uh, this is a happy face no you can't see the difference between them so yeah again this is the MS first body so poseable but uh, most people complain about the hip joint looking a bit weird so yeah, let's move on to the first armor mode. And here is what I so call a light armor form. Um, I decided to actually separate the arm arming of her um, into two separate uh, sessions because she seems to have two distinctive themes. One is the fighter type that we mentioned before in the t in her title, and the other seems to be this uh, half shaman, half schoolgirl theme. As you can see, there is a backpack, look like a school backpack, of except there is actually two thruster on it. But it does open. It's a meaningless feature, but it does open. And her um, shaman-like. Um, skirt dress is um is mechanical but uh, there is two small pieces which opens up and gives her slightly more articulation when she puts her um leg forward uh she comes with one distinctively um japanese oriental style weapon which is this as you can see it's a handle but um also come with a blade into uh, a more shaman like um, exorcism type of sword and of course you can hold it because I didn't put her um, standard uh, holding arm on it, on her yet but yeah that's basically it for the um, light armor mode so let's move on to the heavy armor mode And here is Oscar in full armor mode. Um, you can see that the fighter theme is everywhere now. Uh, it's a bit of a reverse playing because um, the propeller is on the back 
as you can see it spin really well you actually let move left and right up and down and rotate as well if you want to but uh, yeah it's pretty nice and she got wings a typical style um i think it's a probably it's a japanese world war ii fighter theme and yeah this the smaller tail 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 wings are actually here and you wonder if it's a fighter fighter plane where is the landing gear well the first set of landing gear is here on the knee uh, on the ankle and the second set of uh, fighter gear is here uh, at the knee which means that she can actually land properly with wheels on or uh, uh, four wheels to actually touch down and take off which is pretty nice you can see that um, this is more or less what uh, people call the Mecha Musume uh, type of theme which is uh, more based on real um, real mechanical war, uh, war weapon or sci or sci-fi uh, weapon and character and then they just mix in a uh, a female cute character into the into the theme it's pretty nice uh, one thing that is quite naughty or quite um, evil of uh, Konami does is um, they deliberately only supply you with one arm of uh, one uh, arm with the machine gun and the other arm with uh, proper hands on it they don't supply you with a spare arm so you can actually have two arms or two guns they also only supply you with one propeller because this propeller actually fits into the leg uh, connection as well so I'm not going to name it there is an anime recently where a lot of character in there with uh, two propeller legs to actually fly around in a fantasy World War II theme I'm not going to name it you can find it out yourself oh actually there is I think there is a third theme if you notice the years I think it's supposed to be a fox or rabbit I think it's a fox because of um, the way it's actually pointed out pretty sharply I think it's a, I think it's a fox theme uh, weapon wise other than that gun and sword she also comes with two uh, mount machine gun with a mounting point to mount onto the wings it also comes with a um, handle as well so you can so she can actually hold it properly and uh, also she comes with two bombs and also one extra fuel tank I never put the fuel tank on but uh, she does look good with uh, with the extra gun and the extra bomb she does look like a full fledged uh, World War II fighter plane uh, with a cute girl face on it and it's flying backward but then yeah, put her onto the stand whoops Just hold on for a second the stand is the wrong way around there we go yeah so you got a unique uh, connecting point so you can actually so it's unique to her only but yeah, put her into dynamic fighting fighter plane pose and she is quite eye-catching character the one we are, you are looking at right now is not is a back order at the moment but uh, there is a limited version which is called Night, F Night Oscar which is uh, basically reverse all of the color theme where white become black and her hair become uh, white which is a, a very interesting look and I think it's a, it's a pretty fitting character so yeah if you're interested have a look for that one and I'll see you in the next review